Hello, and welcome to my tutorial on how to install Jin Reuse mods. So, let's get started. Okay, so first thing you want to do is go on this site. I will leave a link to it below. What you do is you go to Minecraft, and just go right on ahead to all downloads. Okay, select the version you want. I suggest 1.7.4. Point 10 for this because that's what I'm doing the tutorial for and this is all the downloads you need now if you want specific mods let's say you just want dragon block C uh, this will take a moment <laughs> okay now, what I do for Dragon Block C applies for all the mods, so don't even ask about it. Okay, so what you do is you click on each of these links. Alright. So basically, open them in a new tab. Just to be safe. Just gonna close these two out. Alright. Okay, that should be downloading automatically alright there you go there's one download going and this will actually take a minute or two but I'm just gonna go ahead and open a new tab to each and every one of them if my computer will play nice Okay, so this one's done. You basically click skip add. You do this for each and every one of them. So basically, you wait on this one, blah, 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 blah. You wait on it, you click skip add. Alright, this download should be starting. If it doesn't start, just click this click here button. Like so. Should be doing it in a moment. And I'll go ahead and have this going. Okay. This should be going right now. Okay, this is taking longer than I imagined. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Okay. Um. Whoopsie! Okay, one thing you can do right now. Um. Crap, didn't want to do that. Okay, so you can drag and drop everything you need right freaking here. I'm just going to minimize that. That is no reason to be here right now. Okay, drag and drop. If I could, um... Okay. I see how this is going to be. I can just see it unfolding in my mind. Okay, so... Here, here's the files, most of them. Okay, now for the Dragon Block C file. It was being slow for me for some reason. Again, installing Dragon Block C itself, it applies to Naruto C, Family C, and Years C. So simple. I don't know how anyone can mess it up, unless their computer isn't good enough for the mod. I know I've already downloaded this, but for this video's sake. Okay, I'm going to rename that, because I don't know if it'll mess anything up. Okay. We're done with the browser. Okay. I'm going to drag these to where you can see them. These are what we need for this specifically. 
Okay. Now to get to the point of things, shall we? Okay. So what you want to do is run this, the Forge 1.7.10. Dash ten point thirteen point three point one thousand four hundred three dash one point seven point ten installer jar. Okay, what you want to do is double click it, or if you don't have it set up yet, right click it and then open with Java. And then what you want to do is install client. Give it a moment. Okay, when it says this right here, successfully installed client profile. Forge for version Forge 10.13.3. Click OK. You're done. Okay. What you want to do is go to your dot Minecraft folder next, or wherever you have your profile uh, separate thing for Minecraft. Go to your mods folder. Now I'm gonna get rid of everything in here just to show my point here. Okay. Okay. What you do after this? It's so simple. Okay? Forge is installed. What you do? Highlight the mods. Drag and drop. That's it. That's all you do. Then what you do is you go to Minecraft. This is probably the part where people mess up. By the way, for the record, you're done with this now. This right here, you're done with it. So just do what you want with it. Okay. Now, what you do is you go to your Forge profile, which it's already here. Alright. Okay, now I'm going to show you something. Okay. Notice the name for this. Notice its name. Now look right where my mouse is same exact version now what you can do to make sure is you go to edit profile okay it's in the correct game directory and you can even do a little something so that your minecraft runs one gig of ram for it okay you do this you make sure it's using the right java which can be seen right here i'm gonna highlight it for you okay now, if you don't know what you're doing with Java, don't even mess with the Java settings advanced. Don't mess with it if you don't know what you're doing. Okay? Then you click play. All right, this will take a moment. So don't freak out if it doesn't do it instantly. All right, it should disappear like that. Now you just simply wait. Making a video, tutorial video. Oh. All right. So, when you're starting it up, you should see this screen right here. Meaning, it's loading. It's doing what you want. Okay. Oh, I don't have the right core. Wait, do I not have the core? Yeah, I have the core. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Slight technical difficulty. Alright, so what you do is if you have this situation happen, which I shouldn't have it happen, I'm just gonna take this. I don't want it there. Drag and drop. Move and replace. Hold on, I'm gonna see if there's anything else I got rid of on accident. Um, JBRI client, JBRI client, yeah. There shouldn't be a difference. If there is, that'll surprise me a bit. 
All right, so what you do now... <sighs> okay, ignore this little screw-up. See, that's what will happen if you don't have the core. So be sure you have it. Otherwise, it just won't work. That's probably what some people are having. All these, you freaking install. You put them in here. You drag and drop them into the mods folder. See this folder? It's the mods folder. This will be your best friend for installing and uninstalling mods. Just make sure these files are in here if you just want Dragon Block C. The client, the core, the mod. The core is so that the mods work. The client is so that you can see the modeled hairs and everything. The mod itself, well, self-explanatory. Should be working now. But no, this, this is what you're looking for. Okay. Boom, here you go. The mod is now installed. Click the mods. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Now what you want to do now. Eh, let's make a new one. Okay, what you want to do is, like, see if it works. Loading world, converting world. Uh, Any time now, Minecraft. From here, it's pretty self-explanatory. From here, I will not be explaining any longer as soon as the world loads. And with that, the end of the video is nigh. A.K.A. it's near. For those of you who don't know ye olden English. But no, the end of the video is near. It's gonna take a bit doing this. But yeah, it's pretty self explanatory from here. If you don't know how the mod works or how to activate anything in it, I'll leave a comment on the channel and I will be sure to make a video about that. Oh, look, building terrain. So if you don't know how to activate anything in the mod, let me know, I will make another tutorial video on that as well. And with that, I bid you all a farewell. Have an awesome day. If this helped you, be sure to like, favorite, and subscribe to see more of my tutorial videos on this mod. Now, you know what to do if this helped. You know what to do. Comment, like, subscribe. With that, stay awesome. Peace out.